I'm on the Quark Expedition ship Ocean Diamond and we've just made our way through the Lemaire Channel. You can see the wind is picking up, the temperature just around 31 degrees. We're able today to talk to an expert, Norm Laska, about the ice, the icebergs, and what's going on with global climate change. Norm, we're looking at some impressive glaciers, some icebergs, but the story behind them is, I think, of some concern to experts like yourself. What are you seeing happen down here in Antarctica that gives you some pause? Well, over the last uh, 15 or 20 years, we've seen a significant retreat of the glaciers in this area, particularly the alpine glaciers, and some of the uh, ice shelves have also broken up in that period of time. Is there an effect on this ice melting that's a result of man? Is there global climate change, global warming? Well, there is global warming, and uh, certainly I think the scientific community would say that that's taking place. The real question is how much we're exacerbating that situation. We see since the Industrial Revolution, uh, which is when we started burning fossil fuels, that that's increased dramatically. The ice sheets down here, how do they compare to those in Greenland, which have had a lot of attention? Uh, Greenland is a little more in the public's view, partly because the major population areas are up in that, that region. And in fact, throughout the Antarctic, from uh, satellite telemetry, we're finding that there is significant marginal decrease in, in ice which all relates to uh, not only climate change or global warming, but also to a rise in sea level. The one thing we have certainly noticed is here in Antarctica, if you don't like the weather, wait 15 minutes. For the Weather Channel, Kerry Sanders, NBC News in Plano Bay.